Hey, what's everybody? It's Jason here. I'm going to do a little bit of a different video today. Uh, <laughs> what's up? This is uh, my little buddy Nico there. Um, I'm going to be doing uh, an unboxing video today of uh, this bad boy right here, the, uh, the Vision Grill S Series um, egg. So uh, I'm fairly new to the kind of the egg uh, grilling world. So I picked this up from the local Home Depot here. I'm up in Canada. So uh, I was curious to see what's inside this box here. Um, I mean, the American viewers, you might have a, something a little bit different, um, you know, because some American products are different than Canadian uh, editions. But if it's fish and grills and they sell at the Home Depot, I'm assuming that they're usually generally the same. So uh, let's open this bad boy up and uh, see what's inside. So I just cut the straps off, lift the top up here, of course, typical unboxing stuff. Um, got this cardboard thing here too, but um, if, you haven't, if you haven't ever purchased one of these before, just, you know, these are extremely heavy. Uh, the weight on it, it says caution, it's like 230, 250 pounds or something like that. So I have it on a furniture dolly um, and like any heavy appliance, it doesn't open easy that you can just pop it up. So I'll have to cut the bottom and lift the box up from the, from the top there. Okay, so I lift the top up. You have two separate boxes on this side here too. So let's just pull this off gently, and then open up this guy. Let me go watch right. Okay, so top part here comes off. What's inside there? Nice. Okay, so let's open up the bottom one here. I'm assuming this is all the accessories. Oh wow, look at this fun stuff. Okay, so welcome kit. Warning stuff. So this this is like a manual. Then you got the sides, the handles. This comes off, so you get the full wood handle. This is like a like a PVC, I guess. You know when you do the composite deck boards, uh, it's kind of similar. It has a decent weight to it. We got two handle. Cardboard, legs, wheels. Uh, I guess this is the ash bottom. Oh, this is the top. This is the top part. All wrapped up. Cool. All right. Let's open the big stuff. So in this big, big box, you actually have the whole egg, uh, and it looks like it comes pretty much assembled. So I guess I just have to put on the, put on the sides, the top. Um, the legs and whatnot. So I'm not gonna do all that on video. I'm just gonna follow the instructions, take my time, make sure I do it correctly. Uh, but I will show you guys the finished product. What's up folks? So I uh, did wanna show you something um, during the building process uh, because it came up and uh, I thought it'd just be important to know. So I've done the, the, the legs here and these are actually pretty easy to put together. Um, they give you all the wrenches and the tools and they all come together. Uh, there's two brackets that um, these four leg pieces all come together and you just screw the, the bottom legs on. So that's pretty simple. But the next step is you gotta lift the egg onto the grill and this thing's super heavy. So open it up, take all the stuff inside, outside. So they have the grill, the, the cover, and then I'm gonna take out this interior ceramic part um, just to reduce some weight and you're definitely gonna need uh, two people to lift it on uh, onto the stand there. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are done. So this is the finished product. Now, uh, installation, I said, wasn't too hard. The legs were super easy to put in. The hardest part was lifting it onto the legs there. So you uh, you need two to three people. It, it's super heavy. So I took everything out um, and was able to get it in. And then uh, the handle, uh, the, the shelves, they, um, they're easily marked. So they come with, you know, 5.2, 5.3, 5.4. That's where the screws go in. They kind of lift up like this. This here is for the electric starter. This is sold separately. So I already have one because I already have a, a, a charcoal kettle. Ash pan comes out. And this is where you can put the, the quick uh, quick change gas insert, which I'm planning to get to. Just for lazy stuff, right? If you want to get 
you know, start up the charcoal and stuff when you're in, in a rush too. But you open the lid. And inside, really nice quality. Everything like fits super well. And then this lifts up. So uh, dual grilling services and then you have your your bottom charcoal and you can't really see that down there. So overall I'm pretty I'm pretty impressed with the Vision Grills uh, Kamado grill. So that's it. You know if you're getting to the grilling world, this is one of I guess one of the cheaper ones too, but it comes with more accessories. So maybe that's a good thing. Anyways, I enjoy it. Happy grilling. Stay safe guys.